as children started coming to the center in the early morning hours, news spread around town. Cultural groups were gathered. All focus was to the after-school activity center. Children's World is a German Sierra Leone charity organization with the fundamental aim to promote the welfare of children in Sierra Leone, whose future has been made meaningless by the prolonged civil war from 1991 to 2002 in Sierra Leone. The unprecedented brutal war lasted for 11 good years and left behind brutal memories, amongst which women and children being the main victims. The aims and objectives of the organization shall be to alleviate schools' effort and put more social and cultural values in children with more emphasis on talent building capacity to help develop children's ideas, improve on their skills, techniques, and cultural values, to enable children to compete with other children in educational, social, cultural, and sport activities in and out of their community, to demonstrate self-confidence in creating or doing things that interest children to help improve the output of children in the national primary school examination npse at the end these children will become the role models for other children in the community it is important to remember that the war brought an end to formal education for most young children, especially girls. Adding to this, parents often give their daughters into early marriage as soon as they reach the age of puberty. Therefore, Children's World also aims at encouraging especially girls to appreciate schooling and to discover their abilities. The first set of children's world participants gain admission into secondary school of this academic year 2009-2010. After successfully going through their entrance examinations prior to entrance into secondary schools, 14 girls and 12 boys, these children are very happy to get the opportunity to continue their after-school activities offered at the center. This is the only place most of them have the opportunity and encouragement to do their school assignment or even explore their curiosities as children. Unfortunately, the center is facing serious problems at the moment and that is providing adequate materials to meet the needs of the children in the secondary schools. Most of these children need effective supervision and also the necessary textbooks as most parents cannot afford to buy these textbooks recommended for school use. Just like how they say. <laughs> Children's World is therefore kindly appealing to donors for financial and material help to provide these children with the adequate supplies of provisions. The center has only a tutor who is always at disposal of the children to help them out with their homework. And now that some children have gained access into secondary schools, a better and selective care is urgently needed. On the 1st of July, 2009, 
it was unanimously agreed by the committee to start with the summer school vacation. This eventually took place and the pupils turned out in large numbers. A rule of 135 pupils were in full attendance. It was eventually closed down on the 1st of August 2009. Pupils of classes 3, 4, 5 and 6 were in full swing as they took advantage of the situation. On the closing date, parents were invited to the meeting. The motive of the meeting was to emphasize the importance of the vacation schools and to encourage them to send their children to already established vacation schools in existence. The aim of the summer vacation school is to engage the children's world peoples to undertake further studies for the next academic year. To also address them with new subjects and patterns of teaching they would be faced with later on. To also supplement areas they lack so that by the time schools reopen, they will be able to make a difference. These suggestions to them really bear fruit. The idea was fully appreciated by the parents since the burden of the children rests so much on them. All ended well, however games were organized just to satisfy the desire of the children.